well, well, well. Tana, what's on your mind right now? And I'm still posted up in the Canada. I got to, you know that song? I got to get home to my girls. I'ma paint my slime on the road. I still love my jewelry, even though I slave up. Oh. That's really loud. Just happy if if you watching this, bro. I love him, but like that was crazy. Like it was it wasn't even him for real. It was the board. So I'm 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 a low key like. I'm gonna let him slide. Like we really turned that shit up right after. Like you did. I know how to. I know how to make this shit work. Who was in the pit for that one? And who was in the pit? I think Kani was in the pit too. Like it was a lot of people in the pit. Mosh pit, mosh pit. I fuck with you, my dog. Bitch, keep calling me thugger. She know that I'm Steven. That's um a lyric from my song with um Rich and Mary. It's called. It's called Brash Out. I was flowing in, in the studio. He's like, I said the bar in the mic. He's like, he looks at the booth. He's like, oh shit. I'm like, I should say that. He's like, you should say that. <laughs> and I'm like, bitch, keep calling me thugger. She know that I'm Steven. I just want to show off what I'm into my damn self. If you don't like the music shit, I'm not making it for you anyway, so it doesn't really matter. That is a legendary picture. This is the steak and shake in my hometown. I think like my mom took that picture or my, or my step pops. Um, I don't know, I was just, I seemed like I was having a good time. But yeah, I was at steak and shake with my family. And it's also, that picture is also a cover for one of my songs. I got a song called Patricia, that's the cover. <laughs> baby, baby, Santana. I don't even know who that is. I don't want to say nothing like offensive. It just says baby Santana. I don't, I don't know. Let me see this. He looks more like you than me, look you. <laughs> he looks more like you than me. This looks like him will. <laughs> All right. Taking this shit home. I can take it. It's yours. Put it in my pocket. Come on now. That's a picture of me and my boy John Ross and uh, Uzi just like, he just like interrupted the picture so rudely. Let me see. Look, me, this is supposed to be a picture of me and bro eating a pizza. And Uzi just jumped in so very rudely. But shout out to Uzi. Uh, Love you, twin. Miss you. John, love you, nigga. Miss you. I don't know where this nigga at. He really be ducking, because I'm I'm in his city right now. He, he like, ducking the smoke. Um, and this is me, yeah. We was in um, Thailand uh, for Rolling Loud. Um, this is right before Uzi went on this shit. It was turnt. I struggle so much with this shit, the music gonna speak for itself. I don't remember saying that, but that's the realest shit ever. You're not really allowed to have feelings as an artist, in my opinion, because it's always just gonna come back on you. They're gonna flip it on you. Like, it's always gonna, you know, it's never gonna end up good. So I refrain from saying shit like this, but I mean, the fact that you have it, it's beautiful. Like, I just struggled so much, um, like, figuring out myself and coming up and like making music and just making a world out of my shit and like, you know, like, just like everybody else out there, every other artist, you know, we, we struggle so much. People don't really know the pain put in this shit. And it's just like, I, I can't I can't say nothing. So the music gonna speak for itself, you know? Holy shit, I forgot about that. I literally don't want to say anything. This is a this is just a trailer one day that I dropped. Um, I stayed up all night, by the way, just so I could eat McDonald's hash browns. Cause like, you know, you sleep, you're gonna wake up at 10 o'clock, you're gonna miss the hash browns. So I had to stay awake after I got up the game, ordered some hash browns. I was like, damn, let me make a triller. 
I didn't have no money, cause you know, nigga like me. You know what I'm saying? So I just played some hash browns, you know what I'm saying? Like, that's how this shit go. Had to play some hash browns. That is me and Uncle V's in North Carolina. We was we pulled up on um my boy Elliot Cadeau. If you know him, he's a tough ass player, uh college basketball. Uh he plays for UNC. He's fire. He's fire, number two. Me and V's didn't talk much. We played basketball though. Um who won? Yeah. Shit. Bro, come on. Actually, I won. You I beat V's in basketball. You and V's played one on one. We played one on one. We didn't we didn't play one on one. Oh. We was all just shooting around actually. Yeah. Actually didn't make no shots. You know what I'm saying? I'm not really a hooper. Me and my friends, we were gonna play basketball today though, like, and um I actually made a couple points, you know what I'm saying? I scored a couple layups, a couple, couple threes, you know what I'm saying? Other times I was just shooting too hard and hitting the backboard, but like it, you know what I'm saying? I'm not in the league for a reason. I'm a rapper. Ten of goals go with antisocial. It still hasn't even hit me yet, to be honest. I feel like I gotta see the plaque. I ain't got the plaque yet. I feel like I gotta see the plaque to really like let that shit sink in, but anti-social and go, and um, I'm so very thankful for that shit. Um, I made that song when I was 14, which is so crazy to me. Uh, that motherfucker went up. That shit's all around the world. I play that shit anywhere. They sing, sing the lyrics, so word for word, so yeah. It's just legendary. I'm, I'm so proud of that song. Do you miss that era? Um, For sure, for sure. I had a lot of friends. Um, I was doing a lot of shit. A lot of shit in my mind that goes on now wasn't going on back then. Like my mind was always busy with some, you know, some other shit. Like now life just got so much more real. It's just like, damn, you know what I'm saying? But it ain't nothing wrong with that. You know, you just, life only gets harder, but you learn to adjust, you know what I'm saying? You grow up and growing up is just learning to adjust. So, you know, that's all that is. But Antisocial was a great run. Um, there was another artist on the song too, my boy Slump and the producer of Margins. Shout out to them for, for also like helping me create that that masterpiece. Legendary people. I think this is a recent tweet, right? This is like like a week ago, or two weeks ago. I like to think that I'm sane, but I'm actually really fucking crazy. <laughs> I think that all creatives are insane. I don't think any creatives are sane. You know what I'm saying? I don't think M. Will is sane. I don't think Tana is sane. I think like all when you're in a room with all these like lit niggas and celebrities and shit. Like nobody in there is like regular, you know what I'm saying? That's why y'all are in the same room. When I'm with my boys, I'm like, damn, all of us really crazy as fuck. All of us crazy. We was raised differently, but shit, like, you know, we all went through the shit where we'll go to school, we'll wear some shit and a nigga will call us weird or call us gay or some shit. And we just always been really different without even trying. It's like, I just know that we're, we're, we're we always think outside the box. We're really insane people. Like we're just, we're crazy as hell. Yeah, I don't know. Fuck. Next one. Come on, don't do this to me, bro. Bro, oh my God. All right. Just cause, just cause, all right, come on, bro. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. So it was an early morning in the crib. Um, Faisal was in the room. Me and Ian, we were sleeping on the couch. <sighs> Liam comes in the room. He's like, yo, let's go to the gym. He has this thing, like, he calls everybody chicken. He comes in, he's like, yo, chickens, let's go to the gym. Uh, I had just woke up, so I ain't, I ain't, I was like, all right, bet, but like later, yeah, we can go. Um, Cause you know, I'm not a gym nigga, I don't go to the gym. Uh, I got a gym in my garage at the crib, but I don't even use it. But bro was just like, let's go to the gym. So we pulled up to the gym. Um, this shit happened. I was doing whatever that shit is, whatever exercise that is, and I got clipped. 
it was at a bad time. Like I swear, I'm like, I'm not, I'm not bad. You know, like I could, I really, I, I, there's other shit I'm good at. This, I just don't do this. So I'm ass at this. I don't know what Faisal got going on. He working out in the ricks and shit. His form is fire though. Like, you know, he got the straight back with the, with the legs out, like in Ian just watching over like a fucking mentor sensei. I don't know what's going on. But yeah, this was, this was the most fried shit ever. Um, they clipped us so bad. Yeah. Wait, honestly, where's my phone? Oh, I don't even got my phone. I would show you. I got a video of me in the gym this same day. I was hitting some pull-ups. I was going crazy. Come on now. Legs cross and I'm pulling up arm strength. Form is crazy. What can they say about that? Feel me? What can they say about that? Like form is crazy. Come on, dab me up. We all start somewhere. Exactly. This is just day one. Since that, I've been in the gym every day. Today, I just took a break, went to go play basketball instead, so I still got my workout, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna pop out looking like Lancey. That boy's strong as hell. <laughs> I'm gonna pop out looking like Lancey. <laughs> Come on, I don't even gotta say much. You see it on the finger? Like, come on now. I'm really like, I'm really the one. Um, I played football for like seven years. Like, you can look, you already tell I'm, I'm the one though. Like look, at, like, look at my hand. I got a ring on my hand. Like, I remember when I played for the Colts, I played like four years consecutive and we didn't lose a single championship. Every year we won. I can't find none of my teammates. So whoever was on my team, like, please, get in contact with a nigga. Except Braylon, I know, I know, I'd be seeing Braylon on Facebook, but yeah. I was number 22 on the courts. Shit, I won like four championships in a row. I was going crazy. What position were you? Um, I know a couple years I was a wide receiver, a couple years I was a cornerback. So, yeah. That's about it. I remember when I ran my first touchdown too, shit. I was on the Eagles by then though, I think. I played on the Eagles, but yeah. I was just in some baby NFL, baby NFL league, I don't know. We're gonna be writing. Write down three unknown facts about yourself. What y'all is laughing at? Um. Shit. So the first fact, I'm tall. People think I'm short. I'm not short. People think I'm from Decatur or like Atlanta. Like I love Atlanta, but I'm from Columbus, Georgia. So shout out to Columbus, Georgia, everybody from my city. Um, I get money. Nigga fuck around think I'm broke. I get money. And uh, Skate, his fact was, I'm Skate. Write down three things you are proud of about yourself. <sighs> oh, you want something? Yeah, yeah. Um, you can give me one. Just do that shit. Yeah. Psst, I wouldn't go. Read to me what you wrote. Um, antisocial and go. I'm proud of that. The biggest thing on this list is like I made and I'm making my mama proud. Um, like I know my mama proud of me right now. Shit. I know I'm doing what I said I would always do. The third one is I get money. Cause I get money. Money. Yeah. I'm proud to be skate. Skate star. It's on. I want you to write a letter to yourself, starting with Dear Tana. <laughs> Read to me what you wrote. Dear Tana, I'm proud of you, kid. You ain't never stopped. You ain't never gonna stop. Hashtag private flight gang. Hashtag I get money. 
Hashtag forever thunder. Like, cause that's my boys, you know what I'm saying? That's they shit, so just gotta rep, you know what I'm saying? Us, you gonna tell them what you said? Yeah. I said, dear skate, keep being skate 100. Like, like, the like emoji. 100 emoji though. Like, 50. like the emoji. See? 100 emoji. We're gonna be drawing. Draw whatever you want. Okay. You wanna draw too? Should you got, they put a paper in front of you. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right. Explain to me what you drew. You go I'm gonna go first, or him first? Yeah. Go ahead, sir. Uh, like a cool rubber duck. Uh, Wait, let me see. That back on. Little rubber duck. This Nani. I don't think y'all know Nani, but Nani knows who she is, so when she see this, hey, Nani. Why, why did you draw Nani? Because she's my twin. I love mm -hmm. her. Yeah. Skate, do something. Do me. What does it say? Just skate. I got box Chevy. Got down the rims. You feel me? Got me on the skateboard. Wait. Got what's... the sun. The sky. That's, that's, that's a rough draw. That's Wait, what's that on the back? What's that on the back? <laughs> <laughs> Tanner will be writing down negative things said about him online. Whatever. Write down negative things said about you online. People say like, you know, they hit me with like, unoriginal allegations, you know, they say like, I sound like Doug, and I sound like this guy and that guy, you know what I'm saying? You gotta remember, this is what I grew up listening to though, you know what I'm saying, that's all I know. Um, that gym video went around, people said I was weak. That's wrong. That's just some shit that I don't do. The pull down shit, I don't do that. Um, people say I'm short, I'm tall, I get money. Get that nigga, get that nigga, get that nigga, get that nigga, get that nigga. Oh shit, where that nigga go? Oh shit, bitch that nigga. Bitch that nigga, 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 bitch that nigga. Bitch that nigga. Bitch that nigga. Bitch that nigga, man. Man, make it on sweating and shit. Introducing our new segment, less than or greater than. Powered by Prize Picks. Tanner will be selecting the better album. Oh shit. This is against the rules, but I'm gonna do an equal sign because this got songs like Archive and Gonna Be Okay. But this shit though, like, nah, 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 fuck that. Fuck that, fuck that, fuck that. Planet Sosa wins this one for sure. Fuck. I fuck with Thugger, but shit got hits, but like this shit just got like fucking. This shit got about like 50 of them shits. This one got like like five songs that I listen to every day. So yeah, I fuck with this one. I gonna like this shit. Uzi not gonna like me after this. Uzi not gonna like me. I only say this because like, come on. It's not even about the songs, cause this shit got good songs. This shit got great songs. This is just an influential like album. Like this is art on some shit. This got a lot of songs. Like I remember when this shit came out, a lot of niggas was hating on it. But time passed and people realized. So yeah, that over that. No brainer. Mm. And niggas are gonna disagree with that. Niggas are gonna say what they want. X is hard as hell. Juice was hard as hell. But this shit got all girls are the same. Got Lean With Me. It got Lucid Dreams. This one got, like, it got hits, but this shit, like, all the classics are on this shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, this one got, 
I guess like shit that I still play to this day, like every day on some shit that's in the rotation is like um, dollar sign, dollar sign, dollar sign with Matt Ox. But but like this one, just like those songs are classics and they will never leave my mind. Like Lean With Me is that shit. So that's why I picked this one. I don't know, I'm kind of biased. Like, but I always grew up like a huge X fan more than anybody. It's just like, it's just something about, um, it's just somebody's album, I don't know. I say I say Broken Hearts because like it's just like a classic album. Like it's like the songs is legendary, the world behind it is legendary. This is a like a this album is like an era album. It's like a phase on some shit. It, it got all hits though for sure. Like no misses, but this shit like this just this this is gonna stick with you forever, you know. Watch it, man. Follow that. Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you Tana, the band.
Mitch. That was hard as hell. Oh shit, this one. I see as hell. Now I'm going to Damn, sure. Damn, sure. I stopped doing the cap. <laughs>